Let's take a look at the market this morning. We're uh, 0.28 percent above yesterday's close. Yesterday was a great day for the market. It rallied all day. All day just climbed higher and higher and higher. Uh, the daily here looks great. Had that dip last week, but yesterday came back with a vengeance. Now we're at almost at the top of the range here. Close to it. Maybe we'll bust over today. Maybe not. We'll see. Uh, our watch list, I'm not really loving too much here. I like uh, DKS. That looks all right. And SFIX looks good. Maybe BA. But we'll see what the market gives us today. DKS, we're going to take this right here for a short at the ask. If it gives it to us. All right, we're in. We're in at 35.90. Daily does not look great for a short because it's been uptrending for a while. But intraday, gaps down big. Right now, we got all the buy the dippers coming in. As soon as they're done, I think this thing will turn around, come back down. Stop loss will be uh, around over 36.75. And target, I like it uh, around 35.25. DKS, let's take a look at this thing up close. It's coming down. DKS, all right. This thing is uh, having a hard time here at that 36. If it doesn't drop soon, I'm going to come out of it. DKS, we're going to come out of this right here. I don't like it. All right, we're out. We're out with um, a 60 cent loser, 65 cent loser. Yeah, I don't like it anymore. It should have gone down already, and it didn't, so it'll probably go up higher. We'll take it again later if it turns around. Roku, gonna take this for a short right here at the ask. If it gives it to us. All right, we're in. We're in at 72.11. Daily does not look good for a short. This thing has been uptrending fiercely for some time. But intraday, it gapped down hard and then it flushed. Put put a bottoming tail in down here and now it's going up on one candle, probably just a squeeze. So we're going to see if we can take this down below 71.50. Uh, stop loss will be uh, over 72.50. And target, I like it below 71.50. Or at least around there. All right, it's looking good here. Let's see if we can get a little bit more. All right, we're going to try to take this right here at the 79. If it gives it to us. All right, we're out. We're out for about 30 cents just because the market's uptrending and I don't want to leave 30 cents there just in case it goes up. DKS, we're going to try it here one more time. Looks like it's starting to tip here at the ask if we can get hit. All right, we're in. We're in at 36.50. We got out earlier at uh, 36.56. We took a loss of about uh, 65 cents or so. But I think it's done trying to close the gap, so I think it'll turn around. Stop loss will be over the highs. And uh, target, I like it around 35.75 area. At least below 36. DKS, let's take a look at this thing up close. Starting to work out a little bit. Market's uh, starting to downtrend a little. If we can get some back here. DKS. I'm going to take this right here. All right, we're out. Only a, a 15 cent, or was it 12 cent? 13, 13 cent winner. Oh, and it drops just as I get out of it. Ah, that stinks. I saw the market climbing, and I said, I better get out of this before this thing goes up. And look, now it's dropping. Roku. We're going to try this for another short right here at the ask. All right, we're in. We only got 100 shares. All right, we're full in. We're in at 72.47. Second trade on it. We took it earlier. And we took about uh, 30 cents or so. And it continued to drop because we took it short. Now, 
It turned around. Now it's coming up. I think it's just, just a squeeze here. But the daily is strong, so I got to keep my eye on this one. Stop loss on this one will be over 73. And target, I like it below uh, 71.75 because this just looks like a good size squeeze there. And once that's done, it'll probably come back down. But the market's starting to wake up, so I don't like that. But this one's not really listening to the market today. BA, I'm going to take this right here for a short if we can get hit. Looks good here for some uh, continuation here. All right, we're in. We're in at 384.60. I'm seeing how it broke this area here, so it's probably just going to drop. Daily does not look good for a short. This thing had been climbing for a while. But yesterday it got hit really hard. And it tried to climb, but today it got rejected, and now it's coming down. So I'm thinking it tried to close the gap, and it didn't. It reversed, and market's going up. It's not listening to the market. So next time it goes below 385, I think this thing will drop hard. All right, so here it comes. Target on this one, I like it at least 8350, maybe more, depending on how far it goes. To see it break 84, BA. All right, we broke uh, 383. We'll probably try to take this right here if it gives it to us. All right, we're out. We're out for about uh, 95 cents or so. Oh, and it's still going. It's still going. That stinks. I should have waited. But the market kept going higher. I just wanted it to break 84, 384, and it did. Roku is starting to flag here, so I'm going to come out of this one right here. All right, we're out. We're out of 100. Let me pull that up. All right, we'll full out. We'll full out of that one for, uh, there's that. Just like about a five cent loser on it. Oh, and well now it turns around. Oh, that stinks. Got out of it because it was flagging. And usually when a stock flags, it, it goes up. And now it's dropping. I'm going to take another short here on DKS at the ask. All right, we're in. We're in at 36.87. Second trade on it. We took it earlier, and we took it for a good size loser. Then we took it again, and we only took about uh, 12 cents or 13 cents off of it. But now it looks like it's uh, been squeezed well over the 9, about to where it started to drop before. We might see over 37, but I think this thing turns around and drops. Market is starting to turn, so we might have a little bit of wind from the backside. Here it comes. Looks like it's starting to drop. Stop loss will be uh, probably around 37.30 area. And target, I like it, around 36.25. DKS, all right, it's coming down. Let's see if we can get it below 36.50. We're gonna take it soon because the market looks like it's about to wake up. DKS, we're gonna take this right here if it gives it to us. All right, we're out. We're out for about uh, 25 cents or so. Close to 30. Oh, when it drops. Right after I get out of it. I've been doing that all day today. As soon as I get out, it's like the point where it's just about to move a good a good amount. And I'm getting out just, just before it does the big move. That stinks. It's like three times already today. Look at BA. Let's look at BA. Look at this thing. We got out. We got out at 380, 3.66. Look at that. Look at how much more it's dropped. You know, look at all that I left behind. But the market's not helping 
at all. The market's just, it's up, but it's just sitting there, you know? So it's getting everybody thinking, oh, it's going one direction, then it turns and out, it goes the other direction, but it's not really going any direction, you know? BA, we're going to take this for a long ride here. I think this thing is stretched out, all right? We're in, it's going to be a quick scalp here. We're in that 379.50. Stop loss will be below the lows. And target's going to be over 380. I'm thinking this thing has been downtrending for quite some time here. All right. Here it comes. Let's take a look at this thing up close. Not looking for too much. Just want about a point, maybe a little over a point. Here it comes. I'd like to take it around 381 area. A lot of volume on this today for this stock. But it looks good here. This is a good spot for a turning point, at least for a little bit. You know, a lot of people are going to cover their shorts. Here it comes. All right. That was initial uh, bounce there. I like to see it over 381. I think it has potential. This thing's been dropping for quite a bit. All right. Looks like it's about to pop over. 380.50. There we go. We're going to try to take this right here. All right. We're out. We're out. Oh, again, I got out too early. Look at that. But that's okay. We got uh, about a point and 20 cents out of that thing. I got out right before it was going to explode. Been doing that all morning. But that's all right. We got a little over a point on that one. DKS, look at this thing. We got out of it at uh, 36.61. And it just dropped ever since we got out of it. Did a double top and it just crashed. That would have been a nice ride. And when I was in it, I was like, man, this thing isn't moving. I better just get out of it because it's just going to drive me crazy all day. So I got out of it and look what happened. That stinks. But anyways, that's going to be it for me today. It's a tough trading session. The market was just going nowhere. It was up for the morning, but it was just stuck in this zone here where it was just tricking every everybody. But uh, we're up 313. Let's take a look at the trades. Mostly winners and a couple of losers. Our biggest loser on DKS and our biggest winner on BA. Thanks for watching.